I'm Tony Bruschi. I love good food, and sometimes I believe the best food is found where you least expect it. This is my journey off the beaten path. When you have a view like this out your hotel window, why would you ever want to leave? At the Landmark Resort in Door County, Wisconsin, the only thing I left my room for was some good comfort food at their on-property eatery, the Carrington. From steak sandwiches to delicious feisty shrimp pasta to marinated flank steak. Uh, the steak marinates for about two days. Okay. And then again, it's another one of those things where we'll, we cut up a bunch of them, we'll sure. marinate them for two days, and then we pull them out as we need them. It's one of those places where the view is as good as the comfort food being served up every day. But the dish calling my name was the steak sandwich. Here, Tony. Come eat me. I'm your best friend. Take another bite. You know you want to. I'm delicious. That's good. That's comfort food. You can't beat that. So what's in it? It's actually, um, this is the, the shoulder tender. Okay. Um, and we, we sliced it real thin. It looks, the shoulder tender looks exactly like a tenderloin except smaller. Being a food dork, sometimes choosing between watching steaks on the grill and the view was a hard choice to make. Steaks, the view, steaks you I better check out more of the resort and be a good guest all right thanks man. that was yeah, great you're I welcome. Can't wait to enter Jeff Larson uh, we just celebrated our 25th anniversary last year do you have a lot of folks who've been coming since day one that keep coming back many of our owners we uh, are a condo owner resort. sure uh, many of our owners have been since the beginning yeah and certainly many guests you know whether you're an action kind of person or sure. you want to just kick back you can do it all right on the resort do a lot of folks come here and just never leave property you know, there's some of each. Yeah. yeah some of each. There's some yeah. you never see. Sure. <laughs> and, and I think that's what I like about the resort. Yeah. It's, I, I believe, the best door coming. You know, it's still sure. wooded and a little secluded and quiet. Sure. sure. And if you want the action, you just, you know, drive two minutes into town. Sure. And five minutes up to Fish Creek. Sure. And, uh, sure. Uh, we're very centrally located, nice spot to jump off to. And plenty of time to contemplate my next Door County meal, like a Door County fish boil. If you've never heard of it, here's exactly how it's done. Well, they put it in a pot. Okay. And they do it over an open fire. Okay. And a real big part of the whole thing is the presentation. Mm -hmm. When you do a fish boil, you throw a little kerosene gasoline on the fire. Uh -huh. And that brings the pot, which has already been boiling, sure. to a frenzy, brings the water up, mm -hmm. and it boils over the oil. Oh, okay. okay. So that's where the taste becomes better. Sure, sure. The oil is removed from the fish, and, uh, and then they strain it and dump it out into the... Okay. All this talk of boiling fish has me jealous. Luckily, the landmark has more than enough hot tubs and pools to go around, not to mention one of the best spots in Door County for weddings. But it's the middle of tourist season, so... Where exactly are all the people at right now? I don't really see anybody. I mean, I know it's, it's a very packed house today, but it, I mean, it almost feels like we're the only ones here. You walk around and because it's there's so spread out. There's so much to do and you don't feel like you're on top of everybody. I really like it. I totally agree. Yeah. Uh, it's one of the things we tell people. It's hard to explain. Sure, sure. Um, be spread out over 40 acres mm -hmm. you know in downtown yeah. hotel property it's you're something you never heard of that yeah. same number of people you know are going to be walking through the lobby at one time the landmark in door county is a one-of-a-kind place that truly lets you escape it all even if there is free wi-fi everywhere a lot of good nooks and crannies to read a book exactly yeah. just relax jeff thank you again so much all right, thank all you. right. proving once again that some of the best places are off the beaten path